Hello everyone, welcome to Legit Graphics channel. So this time around we are going to see how you can put a logo on a cap. It's a two-way process and we are going to use Illustrator and Photoshop at the same time. So please make sure you stick around and follow the whole process. back from the short break so let's proceed i'm imagining you also have a logo it may not be legit graphics like this one it may be some other logo of yours you have for me i'm having legit graphics as my logo so the first thing we are going to do is to go to file and move your pointer to export go to save for web legacy and then after clicking it As you see, this kind of menu appears. So it must be saved as a PNG24, the name of the file, PNG24. Make sure it's a PNG24. Transparency should be checked. And then yeah, you can go ahead and click save. So where do you want to save this file of yours? So let me look for my file, my folder where I want to save this. I have this folder of mine which is called mockup files. So let me save this file. Let me try to change its name to So then you can click save it's now saved so what you do you go to photoshop and go to file then you click open so here comes something i'm going to talk about something maybe you've never heard about a mockup file so you're going to use a mockup file to do this Right, for me, I already have a mockup file that I downloaded. I downloaded the template from freepeak.com. So we are going to use a mockup file here. So by the end of this video, you know what a mockup file does. So what we do is, let's look for our mockup file. Let me look for the folder where I saved it, where I stored it. So here is it, isolated white mockup. Click on it and open so here is my mockup file so as you see that on this cap here there is a word here mockup your design so this is where this is the exact place where we are going to put our logo so stick around and see the whole process so let's proceed so what i do i open i go to window and look for the layers panel and click on it then i double click on this your design here you double click on it and then after double clicking on it this will appear will be given place this kind of file will appear and then what you do you go to where you saved your web legacy file of your logo during Illustrator and then you look for it where well, we can just go to file then use open and look for it it's here then click open so after that, you drag it and place it here. Click OK. Then you can go ahead and increase the size.
think we are done. Then you click on this visibility icon here. Then save changes to Adobe Photoshop dashboard. Yes. As you see, it's done. Our legit graphics logo is here. So if I try to zoom it, you see how it's perfectly embedded on the camera. So thank you for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.